Okay, construction C2. Let's see what this is about. Sit down. Oh no, it's up. Whee! Good grief, I've had enough of this now. <laughs> Let's see what this one's about. It's probably sp spacecraft or something. Starting hovercraft upgrade tutorial. Okie dokie. Start a tutorial. This is probably more about engineering. To begin the tutorial, please follow the green line on the floor in front of you to the workshop area. This is the workshop area. The starting hovercraft is here ready to be upgraded, but first you will need some parts. Walk over to the dispenser unit in the corner. Now that you have the parts, walk over to the hovercraft and let's begin the upgrade. Okay. Press the build key while focused on the starting hovercraft to enter build mode. B. Build mode allows you to modify every aspect of a construct. Press the toggle HUD key to lock your screen. Why have I got that still selected from the previous... Um... Go away. Oh well. Press the intro... No, done that. Press the B... Done that. Tab. Tab key. While in build mode for a dynamic construct, the Build Helper toolbar will appear at the top of your screen. Okay. Each Build Helper report icon corresponds to a different aspect of the building of your ship and will display a particular color from white, orange, and red to indicate potential issues. Let's make the report details easier to understand. Click the gear icon on the Build Helper toolbar. Good. Now validate the unit of speed is set to kilometers per hour and change it if necessary. When you are done, click unit the X to close the window. Okay, so unit of speed set to kilometers per hour. Now open the atmospheric flight engineer report. Looking at this report, you can see the starting hovercraft's current max thrust and max speed. Thrust is the directional force provided by engine elements that allows the construct to move. You can also see the high altitude lift item is currently zero, which means this construct is not capable of sustained flight. Lift is the vertical upwards force provided by wings and ailerons on a construct that is required for flight once the minimum forward speed is reached. You can expand each section for more details by clicking the arrows to the left of each item. When you are done, close the window. Cool, cool. For more information on the build helper reports, click any of the icons. When you are done, press the toggle HUD key to unlock your screen and return to build mode. Construction information, fuel manager, atmospheric flight engineer, uh, space flight engineer, axis rotations. Atmospheric Elements Report Space Element Report Common Element Report Engineer Settings Okay, cool. What'd she say? Click what? Oh yeah, tab. Good. Now, press the inventory key to open it. Hi. Locate the element, wing excess. Wing? Right click it and then click equip. You can e also dub good. Now place the first wing, as shown on the large screen on the wall next to the item dispenser. You will need to hold the rotate key and use your mouse wheel to rotate the wing into place. Uh -huh. The arrow should be pointing to the rear of the construct. When the wing is in position, use the left mouse button to place the wing. It's got to be on that thruster type thing side of it. Okay. Uh, oh. Is it on? Is 
that the right or right way round? Let's have a look. Yes, it was. Uh, how far? Right, that's quite a way back. About there, by the looks right. Well done. Now focus on the wing you just placed and press the smart target key. This will highlight the element yellow and allow you to properly align the second wing on the other side of the construct. Oh, okay. That's that's very cool. Press the smart target key, which is U. Okay, you got U. U. Good. Now place the second wing as shown on the screen in the back of the workshop. It should highlight yellow when it is aligned with the other wing. Very oh, good. That's, that's Press really the cool. Toggle HUD key to lock your screen. That is really cool. Uh, that is excellent. I love that. I love that. That's so useful. Right. Press the toggle HUD. Okay, tab key. Now open the atmospheric flight engineer report again. Set it again. <laughs> Looking at this report again, you can now see the high altitude lift is no longer zero. Your construct's new wings should provide enough high altitude lift for sustained flight. Okay. When you are done, close the window. High altitude lift lift is now six point seven two. Okay, Ducky, this is going to take a lot of messing around with. This is freaking awesome. Press the toggle HUD key to unlock your screen and return to build mode. Yes, ma'am. Press the build key to exit build mode. Right click on the hover seat. Go to run default auto configure and click on pilot flying construct. Click pilot. yes at the prompt. Pilot. Did you say click on that? Pilot and flying construct. Uh, she said pilot. Was I supposed to have done that? Press B. Okay. Right click on the hover seat. Go to run default auto configure and click on the pilot flying construct. He hasn't said anything. I'm gonna get out. How do I get out? Leave. Right click on the hover seat. Go to run default auto configuration. Oh, right, okay. Silly me. And click on the uh, pilot flying construct. Apply it. Okay. Run an auto configuration. Warning: This will erase and overwrite your cr custom LUA Lua script and is irreversible. Are you sure you want to continue? Yes. Congratulations. The construct is now ready for sustained flight. Okay. You can use the interact key on the hover seat to take it for a test flight. When you are ready to leave the tutorial, use the exit teleporter located at the waypoint on your HUD. When you are ready to leave the tutorial, use the exit teleporter located at the waypoint on your HUD. Okay, are you trying to tell me to bugger off, are you? I gotta go around here. That was uh, a lot simpler than I was expecting. The tutorial, that is. Not so much what you're going to do overall. Pretty damn cool. Right. <laughs> right, go away. Let's get out of here. Is this the one that's highlighted? Spoiled it is. I'm not going to miss something if I go. She did say exit tutorial. I'm just going to just check something. Where's the waypoint again? It was over there. It's vanished. 
well I'll just go the way I came back came in came back <laughs> boom excellent you are now ready to go hunt for your free tile it's probably also a good time for you to deploy your speeder now so that you can travel faster if you want to do so go in your inventory and double click on the speeder blueprint then deploy it in the world now to proceed further I'll be waiting until you have deployed your sanctuary territory unit. Cool. That's it. That's the end of uh, that construction one. That's the end of the construction one. <laughs>